Welcome back everybody, this is Always back with another video on the channel. I'm going to be showing you how to fix unverified breakpoint bugs in VS Code debugging. So here's an application running. We're going to go to app component.ts file. I'm just going to do a breakpoint here and it says unverified breakpoint. So if I refresh my application, it does not really debug this. It does not really get this um, breakpoint. Now, I was trying to figure out how to fix this. So, you know, when you do, uh, when you do go to debug section, you go to add configuration. And then here you have a configuration for your debugger. Now, just to fix this problem, I'll just paste my settings. I'll drop these setting in the description as well. So if you want to just copy paste this, you can do that as well. I'm going to save this and I'm going to stop the debugger and then I will start the debugger again. So let's click on this play button. It's going to open up the browser and now I'll go to app component.ts file and in the constructor function, as you can see, it's actually looking at this break button now. So if I let it go, yep, that's working. Now just to show you one another function that we can check. So I will go to home component.ts file and then here, in send email verification function. I'm just going to log that as well. And then I'm going to click on this get started button and it's going to, you know, call this function and then enable the debugger for me. Now, as you can see, by simply changing the configuration, I figure out this after a lot of search. So I'll just paste that in the description. All you get to do is add this uh, source map to true and source map path override so basically it's a problem with the path so you can do that by you know adding this configuration so that was a quick video to show you how to fix this All right so that's about it for this video guys thanks for watching subscribe and like the video if you do think it helps you so yeah thanks for watching talk to you guys later